our dear One viewers song. and to of course this amazing special guest that we have today with us uh, my name is Meher Jan and you're watching Pakistan Facts and today we have with us an extraordinary artist her work is creating waves on the internet and um, you must be living under a shell if you haven't seen it yet especially her awesome oil painting of who else but the character, main character of Arthrugul. So um, it's a fantastic work and it has caught the attention of a lot of people. And I'm so glad to have Hamda Farooq with us today, who will be talking to us about her amazing journey. Amazing in the sense, because this is something that you might not know is that she's a self-taught artist. So um, yeah, it itself is a huge achievement. So we are very much interested and looking forward to speaking to Hamda. So Hamda, thank you so much. Welcome to Pakistan Facts. How are you doing? Thank you so much for having me. I am so honored to be here. Awesome, awesome. Uh, Hamda, how does it feel? Because you have become a sensation overnight. Your paintings, they're just, you know, here and there, I'm seeing your videos and mm -hmm. I'm seeing all these different posts coming up. So how does it feel? It feels amazing and kind of surreal at the same moment. I mean, I don't know how to describe it, <laughs> right? But it right. is amazing. Alhamdulillah. Great, awesome. Um, it's a, a very much appreciative when we have such kind of amazing talent in Pakistan, and I'm really very glad that all the different channels and you know media is portraying it how it should be done. So uh, let's mm -hmm. start off from the beginning, Hamda. If you can just let us know that mm -hmm. your interest was from to start painting. <clears throat> well. As a child, I knew that okay, I was good at arts. So in school, I started port uh, painting portraits, basically. Mm -hmm. And bahan se phir, it kind of took off. And then I recently started officially working on my art career. Mm -hmm. When I started with my online series, uh, which mm -hmm. is a video content series. So I recently started officially. And other than that, uh, since school, I've been painting portraits and I've been famous for that in school, mm -hmm. in my town. And uh, I've won many ca competitions in, at school level. Okay, so, that's awesome. So you definitely got the nudge from school days itself. Okay? You were exactly. destined to do this on the huge, in a huge, huge Pretty way. much. <laughs> uh, I mean, I was sure okay, I'm going to stick with it. This is something special. Like, I'm not going to leave it. It's a part of me and I have to... I, I won't abandon it. This is something I was okay with. Right. And then, awesome. uh, yeah. great. And what about your family? I'm sure they must have played a role as well, giving you the motivational boost. Okay. Um, you know how it is in our culture. I mean, it's just a small hobby. That kind of a from, you know, frame of mind is still there. So in your case, mein, did you have that kind of a boost and motivation from your family members, your parents? Can anybody continue this? You have a talent, you have a gift. I've been actually lucky that way because I belong to an artistic family. No, so okay. all of them are pretty artistic. Koi singing me, koi koi arts me achha hai. Matlab it's it's like that. So parents ki tarf se there is always a support to go for our dreams and follow mm -hmm. our passions. Okay, awesome. Chale that 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 really came in your favor. Ki family artists ki hai, to phir to definitely they would yeah. be supporting you as well. <laughs> yeah. That's great. Thik ho gaya. So um, is it just oil painting, Amda? Ya aap kisi aur bhi JK? Do you try to use some other kind of a um, you know platform or other techniques and tools as well? Ya abhi tak abhi aap oil painting pe focus karna chahiye when it comes to the portraits. I I am focused on oil painting because in my point of view, oil painting is the biggest medium that was used through the renaissance period and all the great artists of the time have used or unki paintings are the store oil painting has a very special place in the world and i it has a certain type of a uh, certain type of feeling to it ki matlab this is like gonna stay and like mm. and an importance to it you know oil paintings so right. but i would love to explore more or mm -hmm. I want to explore more or mediums and techniques, etc. Inshallah. Okay. Inshallah. Yeah, we yeah. really hope so too as well. Or uh, Hamda, did you, uh, as of here, did you get also any international exposure? Or uh, is that something definitely that you would like to have on your cards? Do you want to go to international exhibitions in the future? Do you want to represent an international platform in the future? 
exactly i would love to this is on my list ki i have to go to international market physical exhibition expi- expi- exhibitions wahan pe karne hai and uh usko reach karna hai market ko and pre- represent karna hai pakistan ko right inshallah inshallah we really hope so we really want to see your name as well on those big billboards or uh, inshallah we are really looking forward to that also or uh, let's just talk a little bit more about your this uh, voices series jo aap jiski abhi baat kar rahi thi what Jee. exactly is that i mean usko thoda zara hame bata de acha so this all began uh, a while ago i was like in a place where i wanted to i felt ki i had a lot of bottled up thoughts inside of me and i wanted to say something things that mattered things that i wanted to portray for such a long time then i started thinking ki how do i do it and then painting is the first thing that came into my mind ki this is something i'm good at to isi mein i can express myself the best and then i started with my voices series and this included the idea behind it was ki i have to portray my own voice and i have to portray the voices that matter around the world that i feel like should be talked about and that i feel like should be conveyed aage right. focus on those voices awesome and us pe based on that there were different chapters that i made different paintings wo they were all chapters basically different chapters touching on different topics wagera acha very interesting to isme aapko abhi tak response kaisa mil raha hai from the audience from the viewers bahut bahut acha mil raha hai abhi tak allah ka shukar hai and i Achha. hope it grows further and further great yeah. awesome awesome so um is there anything else that you're working on right now hamda ek to aapki atrugul to hum waisi hamari is pe bhi nazar hai lekin uske alawa bhi there something that we should be looking forward to you will be in unveiling soon Yes, yes i, I am, working am working on my second uh, series and usko maine start kar diya hai and that will be like a surprise wo bhi special hai kaam uske chal raha hai chale awesome yeah. looking forward to it uh acha ye hum the when i say a self taught artist that definitely means ke aapne koi as such koi professional classes wagaira nahi li ya koi professional training nahi li but you must have gotten that kind of uh, um, thoda sa to aapka platform build karne ke liye you must have picked up your skills from somewhere there was it youtube tutorials or what exactly jo ki we have a lot of people in pakistan jinka hai to see talents but koi ke unko bhi ek nut chahiye so i'm looking up to someone like you has mashallah created so such a big platform for herself apne hi balbute pe apna hi sara khud bana ke so uh, what exactly did you how did you actually start off ke main ji yahan se shuru kare and then it developed and you know progressed on um to be honest i didn't have a specific source jahan se maine learn kiya ho ke i have to learn these these things uh, when i started uh, um, i think the process has taught me a lot when i start with something the process takes control and i learn and i i'm like could the unconsciously mind work kar raha hota ki iske sath is tarah karna hai kaam and this will go better with this thing so the process take con- takes control and it helps in learning and other than that i obviously w- would love to learn from whichever source i get matlab if i feel like i have some shortcomings i try to overcome that and i try to focus on that aur main chahti hu khud mera aim hota hai ki next painting mein us tarah ki shortcomings na ho Mm-hmm. so this is how i basically recognize my own shortcomings and then i try to overcome that and okay. internet is also a help like if you want to learn some other techniques and stuff so mm-hmm. there are a lot of people who are teaching on the internet right also awesome. yeah that gives an exposure like an idea great great uh and what when it comes to the government support may you can i really emphasize on this ke we have you know mm. we have a lot of different sectors and we have a lot of different campaigns and organizations jo different cheezon ko boost deti hai and they try to help it out but when it comes to arts i mean if nothing else arts is something that is definitely going to put pakistan on the map and then when we have people like you arts like you jo is kisam ka it's kisam ka itna amazing kaam kar rahe hain which will definitely give us that kind of positive image that we desperately need in these days mm-hmm. so isme if there's something that you would also like to pitch in ke government ki support kis tarah aani chahiye when it comes to helping these kind of artists jo apne ye ke they like emerging artists but they need that kind of a boost and a nudge from the government as well as support Hmm. I think the media can play a big part in that to promote local talent because our media there's a lot of space 
इन देर के वहां पे वैल्यू uh, जिनकी है ना जिन लोगों की उनको बुलाया जाए जिनके काम की वैल्यू है उनको प्रमोट किया जाए अदर देन दैट आई फील लाइक के ओवर द इंटरनेट भी काफी फैसिलिटीज प्रोवाइडेड प्रोवाइडेड की जा सकती हैं बाय द गवर्नमेंट एंड सच एज देर लॉर ऑफ फ्री लैंसर्स लाइक यंगस्टर्स सिर्फ आर्टिस्ट नहीं वैसे भी तो अगर लाइक ईजी पेमेंट सर्विसेज वगैरह जो इंटरनेशनल मार्केट से हमें कनेक्ट करती हैं अगर वो हमारे बीच में ब्रिज बन जाए एंड आर मेथड्स ऑफ पेमेंट वगैरह इस तरह की ईजी हो जाए चीजें टेक्निकल पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू से देन आई थिंक काफी काफी इस तरह इंकरेज होगी एक्टिविटी जो भी काम कर रहे हैं एंड आई थिंक दिस इज वेरी क्रिटिकल एट दिस पॉइंट इन दिस एज कि आप कनेक्टेड हो पूरे वर्ल्ड के साथ exactly very much needed or i think in today's day and time jab social media uski obviously that has its negative impacts but then it has its positive side too to usko ye ki utilize karke there's a lot of things that we can actually create and we can actually create a huge cultural bridge jisse ye ki hamari apni jo thodi bahut is kisam ki misunderstandings hai misconceptions hai un pe target bhi kiya ja sakta hai तो हमदा रियली होप कि आपके आगे भी प्रोजेक्ट्स में यू क्रिएट सच काइंड ऑफ वर्क जो पाकिस्तान को इन अ पॉजिटिव लाइमलाइट लेकर आएगा वेरी मच नीडेड इन दीस डेज तो ये कि आई वेरी मच लव्ड टॉकिंग टू यू एंड बट बिफोर आई लेट यू गो एज यू नो इंटरनेशनल वुमेंस डे इज कमिंग अप एंड वी आर डेफिनेटली हाईलाइटिंग वुमेन हु आर क्रिएटिंग अ मार्क एंड हु आर गिविंग अस दैट काइंड ऑफ मोटिवेशनल बूस्ट कि नहीं हम भी कुछ कर सकते हैं तो योर वर्ड्स ऑन दैट व्हेन इट कम्स टू वुमेंस डे और क्या हमें क्या करना चाहिए व्हेन इट कम्स टू द पाकिस्तानी आवाम टू आवर वे ऑफ थिंकिंग कि हम किस तरह औरतों को उनको सपोर्ट कर सकते हैं इनकरेज कर सकते हैं फॉर देम टू यू नो कम आउट आउटसाइड ऑफ देयर कंफर्ट जोन एंड यू नो एक्सप्रेस देमसेल्व्स इन अ बेटर वे तो आपके इसके बारे में क्या व्यूज हैं कि हम औरतों को किस तरह हम ये कि इस किस्म की फ्रीडम ऑफ एक्सप्रेशन दे सकते हैं Oh, I don't know where to start with that. There are a lot of <laughs> you things, take your time. a lot of ground <laughs> to work on. Um, I think start from the basics, and there are a lot of things that could be worked on. And mentality needs to change for the better. You know, the patriarchy needs to be eradicated. And uh, for women, I think workplace. If we simple terms, we talk about it. Because workplaces, pay equality. एंड स्कूल लेवल पे एंड बाहर जाने में टू गिव वुमेन दैट फ्रीडम और उनको ट्रस्ट लेवल वो दिया जाए तो आई थिंक दैट कैन हेल्प अ लॉट एंड नॉट उनको दबाया ना जाए तो ऑन अ बेसिक लेवल डे टू डे लेवल देर आर लॉट ऑफ थिंग्स दैट कुड बी लिटल लिटल थिंग्स दैट बॉर्डर एंड पता नहीं कहां से पर कहीं से स्टेप लेना पड़ेगा आई आई अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट यू आर सेइंग आई मीन डे टू डे थिंग्स पे फोकस करना चाहिए कि कि उनको दबाया ना जाए मतलब छोटी-छोटी बातों से उनको इस तरह डिग्रेड ना फील कराया जाए कि कि आपकी वैल्यू कम है इस तरह ना उनको फील कराया जाए मतलब हमारा एक जो conventional Those framework like, say hat ke thoda sa if they have something different exactly. to say don't just don't give them that sort of a shut up call let them express yeah. themselves how they want and to. that is a very subtle way of you know uh, pushing them down to aap inko like long ko realize bhi nahi hota na ke ye this is what they're doing because that is that has go, that has been going on for so long so that is a very subtle way of pushing them down mm. and that needs to be eradicated right awesome i love that point of yours you can you, you're right in the in the sense ke ek cheez jo bitne saalon se itni generation se chali aa rahi hai they assume ke it's fine it's part of our culture but mm. then that is where it's wrong that is exactly is. i absolutely agree with your point and i really hope this reaches out to our a lot of viewers <laughs> and hamare mard jo hazrat ko bhi thoda ye is cheez ko leke wo bhi sunne aur samjhe mm. ke let us come out of our shells let us speak up yeah. let us say something and if it's different from what you think let let it let it be koi baat nahi i mean we yeah. have our own and way of thinking and it's not about who's better and who's not it's about treating each other the same way you would want to be treated it's about yes. realizing the other person is also human just like you are that's the whole point of view of the movement and not ke uh, you know i'm better than you or you are less than me it's right. just about treating and realizing that this is the same person mm-hmm. just as i am you mm-hmm. know there's no difference 
Awesome. I agree with you and I hope it really reaches out. Logon ko iska ye ki thoda idea ho and um, and then obviously it just you know it gives you the wings to express yourself in a beautiful way. Phir aap dekho ki kya kya aur kis kisam ke apne ke apne aap ko represent kar sakti hai. So thank you so much Hamda. I was very much looking forward to talking to you as soon as I saw your work. I was like ye main to is bandi se baat karni hai. I absolutely you are taken a wag by how amazingly you've done your work and especially being someone who's a self-taught artist. So, uh, Pakistan Facts wishes you the best with your future endeavors, and uh, we hope to see your name as well when it comes to international exhibitions and artists thank showcasing you. their work. So, thank you thank so you. much, Hamda. It was a pleasure talking to you, and uh, wish you the very best. Thank you so much. The pleasure was all mine. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day.